in Crescent versus uh, RFA. Along with a few other people. So shout outs to the NC crowd. Shout outs to out of state players who came, uh, giving us some hype, hype matches. Oh, yeah. All the hype has been falling since top 16. Oh, yeah, so. it is. And here we go. And this is a loser's match, so loser of this would get seventh, I believe. I believe so. Starting off on the battlefield. Go! Oh, I wish we had it for us. Ah, right. <laughs> That cross lash coming through, good anti air, gonna stuff a lot of stuff. Stuff a lot of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> stuff and a lot of stuff. Stuff right some now. stuff, man. Uh, Crescent, you know, popping these pellets off, just doing that tip for tat damage. Um, the thing is, uh, this is really tough for Crescent because, not because of the matchup, but just because he really has to play it so tight he can't get hit. Yeah. He's got to build way more percent exactly. than Cloud does. The KO differential is astronomical. So, um, you know, Zephyr has a lot more room for error. Yeah. He, he can kind of play around. He doesn't have to constantly win neutral to take the game. So, Crescent is going to need to be pretty much perfect in terms of neutral game, building that percent big, and already not looking too great, eating 80% quickly, already headed into that um, limit cross slash range. Yeah, probably about another 10, 15%, depending on stage positioning. You see him probably looking for it right there. Zephyr still just holding the um, stage control right now, keeping Crescent on the defense. Indeed. Oh, oh no, yeah, he's going to try. Yeah, oh, that, that's, that's going to do it. That, that is it. Crescent stole uh, that away. Giving a nod, kind of like, okay, yeah. I, I guess I well, guess I'll take that. I saw him do that <laughs> at uh, Smash Sons Frontiers Weekly this oh, past yeah, last, week versus last week. Um, somebody. Except then he did a footstool, but I guess uh, since he had just started the leaf shield, he was confident that the hits would last long enough to catch a secondary recovery oh, attempt. Yeah. So, um, really just stealing that stock out of the depths there for Crescent. Gonna need to tackle on a decent amount of percent if he wants to keep a second stock going strong. Yeah. Oh, he yeah. A double back here. Crescent's gonna want to put on about another 25 to 30 percent, I think, before he feels really comfortable heading into the next stock. Oh, yeah. I would say even more. He's got to stretch this out as yeah. long as he can. Well, that's the thing. Mega Man is a great character to do that, you know? Yeah. I've made the comment before that Mega Man with the lead and Mega Man behind are kind of two different characters. Yeah. Completely different. And Mega Man at 177 right now. Luckily, you know, that dash attack did not kill him. Mega Man. Oh, that's going to be trouble. Oh, oh, that's a spike! Good gracious! Two stock! Zephyr coming out swinging really hard on that first stock, but Crescent taking all the momentum, destroying Zephyr's stocks both times. Yeah, I really, really respect that whole edge guard scenario. He threw the projectile out to kind of cut off the uh, easy route to the stage, forcing them to go low. Knew he had to burn the limit. Knows hard knuckle was basically a projectile that spikes, and that was able to cut through. Really smart uh, edge play there from Crescent to stick to the. And that's Cloud. That's Cloud in a nutshell. I mean, Zephyr was dominating pretty much both stocks yeah. on stage, but he got off stage twice, and that was two stocks. He has got to be a little bit safer than that. He can't get caught off stage. Crescent is no slouch when it comes to the edge guarding game. Yeah, I want to see if he makes these adjustments going into game two. Uh, you know, losing stocks like that could fluster a player. Um, so we'll see, you know, how the middle fortitude is uh, going in here in game two. Yeah, and Crescent, knowing knowing that he really kind of stole that match from Zephyr um, on both stocks, he's going to want to try and keep keep that momentum going and hope that Zephyr is kind of flustered from that, not let him get any ground. And Already looking way better in the neutral. Indeed, game. yeah. He's definitely controlling the pace of the matchup. If you notice, the pace of the matchup has changed completely from the uh, first time. Oh, oh and Zephyr goodness. answering back, though. With a with spike that, of his own. Yeah, clean edge guard from Zephyr. Almost Not flipped the script. Any of that. Yeah, flipped the script from the first game where Crescent was getting dominated and got the spike. And this time it was Zephyr getting dominated against the spike. Yeah, and ooh, eating just that last hit of limit cross slash. Yeah, to that's, on a little bit more damage. That but. Sneaky little, oh, went for the shore. You, wow, this, the reach on that down smash is nothing to trifle with. Yeah, they're back here. Coming through. Cloud now in a yeah, great Zephyr position. About to pick up limit right now. Crescent gonna wanna end this stock right now. Yeah. He's in an off stage position, he's gonna catch limit. And there it is. So 
Zephyr on the verge of lapping Crescent. Honestly, he doesn't even need any more percent to end this. No, one uh, one anything will do. One smash attack. Yeah. That'll There's do the it. There's cross slash. So takes the stock. Answering back with a two, two stock, stock of his own. Of his own. <laughs> Playing up to the crowd a little bit. A little good nature playing up to the crowd a little bit. I like it. But I don't know if you really want to rattle the, the cage of the NC audience. Yeah. The NC definitely not quite bringing it, um, the hype as much as usual, even though you can barely hear in this room. They've got a lot more ready. Get loud. Yeah, so we can't hear. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to hear. Yeah, I don't want to hear. So we're on FD. This is going to be, oh. Couple back airs there coming through, looking for the roll in, didn't give it to him. Down, smart down tilt there, sneaking under the pellets. Zephyr. I mean, Zephyr just gets so much bigger damage. Yeah. Um, Even off of stray hits, you know what yeah. I mean? I mean, it's just, uh, Crescent has to work so much harder to build the damage. Good use of uh, Metal Blade there to track down the roll to the ledge yeah. from Zephyr. Good recovery there from Crescent to get back to stage without taking any edge cards. Oh, ledge Trump situation. Oh, and great usage of the jump right there, holding yeah. onto it through his up B, but still off stage, not out of the woods yet. This is a scary place to be against Cloud with so many good uh, options to cover ledge. But didn't cover the down tilt there. Yeah, 122, horrible position for um, Crescent to be in right now. He really needs to, you know, get the advantage um, stage-wise. Honestly, get Cloud off stage. Yeah. And if you, that uh, limit has to go right now. Mega Man's going to want to play this laterally. You know, he's going to want to be even with Cloud. Um, gets the pivot grab, and he's got that leaf shield. Primed, uh, but oh, an air and air dodge there. Yeah, Zephyr not going to fall for the same thing twice there. Yeah, or rather an ill-advised, not necessarily air Oh. oh! Oh! Oh, but he recovers because Mega Man. Yeah, only 18% on Mega Man. Yeah. Great upbeat. Hop right back into the match. 103% on Zephyr. Crescent needs to get it started right now if he wants to stay in this match. Yeah. Every percent that he takes, it just makes it that much harder for him to come back on stock two. Yeah, and Zephyr's going to be content to take these trades. Ooh, and Crescent not quite capitalizing on the missed, missed um, down tilt there from Zephyr. Crescent spending way too much time in the ledge yeah. this entire match. Zephyr has uh, kind of shored this match up simply just from playing and having exceptional stage control. Crescent is struggling so hard to get back to center, but and Zephyr is just continually choosing the correct options. As Zephyr has totally lapped Crescent, and you know, Crescent not having Ryu on his side right now, there's not a whole lot he can do with yeah. Rage. Not even, I mean, even back here right there, not in the stock, but. So, this is certainly not undoable for Mega Man, but he's going to need a uh, wacky. He needs, he needs to get caught off stage yeah. right now. <laughs> As the Cloud starts chanting, just one yeah. grab. Oh, that's oh, going to do the it. Corner takes it. Zephyr shutting up the crowd right there. Yeah, he turned around with that shush. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm expecting a character switch. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm really expecting the Ryu to come out. Like we said, talking about it might not be a great matchup for Ryu. I mean, Ryu still has so much, um, you know, on his side to where he's never out of it. Even if he's struggling in neutral game, yeah. his kill, his kill um, ability kill alone potential will make a just... Plus, with that, um, he's a little bit more uh, able to trade you know, damage with Cloud yeah. because of that. So. Yeah, he, he goes tit for tat a lot more evenly than Mega Man does. So. That sure you sneak it up under the pla under the edge there to afford him a way back on. It's going to be snatched up out of that focus into a down throw back here. Zephyr not letting him get anything here right now. Ooh. Zephyr's doing a good job of respecting uh, Ryu's back air. If you notice, he's like taking the back air and sitting in shield. Yeah, yeah. He's not really. Um, he's he's showing a lot of discipline and not not really walking into a lot of the freebies that um, Ryu gets. Exactly. 
It's every uh, coming through that back here, catching him before, while he's locked into that dash animation. Yeah, 133 percent to 30. Crescent. As we can see, Ryu oh. maybe not being the answer here, but you know, Crescent on his last leg, not Indeed. a whole lot of options. Zephyr with some uh, an exceptional performance here since game one. <clears throat> Ryu oh. start, trying to get it started. He's trying to get something started. Yeah, I mean, Ryu definitely still in this. Only 23%. He can close out this stock. Oh, that's the focus. Oh, Ooh, throwing out the um, sure you can. Yeah, it's it looks like he was going to walk right Exactly, yeah. He was looking to like, stuff an approach with that yeah. sure you. Yeah. Um, getting into a lot more dangerous percent here for Crescent, though. As the comeback seemed real for just a moment, Zephyr just stuffing him. Yeah. Zephyr's playing this matchup. Damn near perfectly, to yeah. be honest with you. Oh, yeah. And he's playing almost perfectly. Oh, and Spot Dodge is the sure you can. Crescent needs to end this stock right now. He's going deep for it, as you see oh, right there. Yeah. Goes super deep for it. No punishment on the short field. Oh. A back hit of that up smash is going to take it, so super good play from Zephyr. Oh, yeah. I mean, that was honestly nearly flawless. 